Hello and welcome to another video. This will be another Boogie 2988 reaction. Um, we finally uploaded again a video I can react to. The last two I didn't react to, one of which was a stream, another was just a re-upload from his podcast channel. I would have reacted to the other video, but, um... Uh, I already saw most of it, so it makes sense, so... Anyways, with that being said, let's get into this video. Also, I'm gonna party with Hunter and Julian right now, so... There is that. So, anyways, let's start. What's up? Ladies and gentlemen of YouTube, we get to 988 coming at your lives against the power of the internet. And it's been a week since I got back from England. And it's time to figure out what to do with all my fight stuff. And on top of that, I also made a bet. I bet Jordy my silver play button versus his silver play button that I could win the fight. And obviously I lost. I think Jordy's already forgotten about the play button, but I have not. So I gotta mail that to him. In order to mail it to him though, I gotta find it. <laughs> Jordy, you're not getting the gold one. As simple as that, okay? We did not wager the gold one. Some people said I should send you the gold play button. That ain't happening. Let me show you why. Okay, first off, I decided to put my fight shorts here. So yeah, I'm in a reaction right now. Uh, but I, I suggest that you were next to me and do that you want to. Something like that. I still have the tape that went on them as well. Maybe I could sell them. Donate the money to charity. Let me know if somebody out know, there is interested yeah. in buying these. Yeah, but, look at that. Right. here's the gold play button. I don't think you understand how heavy and massive this thing is. This would cost a fortune to mail you. So we're going to have to go dig up one of the silver play buttons and send that to you. But I genuinely don't know where they are. Genuinely don't know where they are. A little more fight memorabilia. Here's the actual gloves that I wore. And let me tell you, these are very different from the Everlast gloves I wore during practice. These, once they're laced on, and once your gloves are taped up, they were like boulders, man. Uh, 16 ounce gloves. Those but it was a completely different fight. experience than finding with these regular that. gloves. Yeah. I, one of the things they don't prepare you for. Very different gloves that you use in the ring. But okay. I don't know uh, answer that question. what'll happen to these. <sighs> Maybe I should sell these too, I don't know. Also from the fight is the gun meme shirt. This is the old Tomb Raider shirt that I wore that fateful day, which Chase ripped off of me as we were getting into the ring. This probably just goes in the trash, right? I don't really want to keep it. I don't know if anybody out there would want it or why they would, but probably time to put that behind me. So here in my living room is a bunch of my memorabilia. Stuff made by fans oh, like or that I purchased at conventions oh. or that have been given to me as gifts by a friend. I mean, there's some really amazing stuff in here. And I thought my play button was going to be in here as well. I've definitely got some YouTube stuff like my PlayStation and then grab my name on it and stuff. I don't know. There's some cool stuff in here. Let me show you some of my favorites. Here's a little 3D printed version of Boogie. This is actually oh, made as a prototype cool. for a figure long before there was U2s or anything like that. And the people that were going to do this for me was the Skylander team. We never released them because they were going to end up being like $30 each. So I didn't think fans would want to pay all that much. So we skipped it. For those of you who don't like my new smile, let me remind you what my old smile looked like. These are actually my oh, old teeth. So well, I mean, half. Because I only had 17 left on the day they pulled them for my implants. Everything else had pretty much rotted away. If you guys remember, in 2019, he, he got surgery with his teeth. Um, because his teeth was pretty bad beforehand. But, um... He, in 2019, he paid like $40,000, even so I could have mentioned it in the last uh, reaction I did on his channel about that. Um, but yeah, that's his old teeth. Um, he's with much better teeth now, so I have noticed that. But uh, yeah, I'd rather have these than those, and I hope you'd rather I had them too. 
For those of you who collect pop vinyls, I've never been that crazy into them anymore. But here are some prototype pops that got sent to me by the folks over at um, GameStop back in the day. Sora, Goofy, uh, I presume these are very rare. Tell somebody get a hold of Max Mofo. See if they're worth anything. Here's one that's really interesting. I did the True Jordy podcast. We talked about being from a long line of coal miners. Well, my nephew, Jason, sent me this from back home. Sugar Hill Brewing Company. That's the brewing company now in the small town of St. Paul that I lived in. And here's some coal from the coal mines, the coal field coal mines that my dad mined back in the day. Nice. Actually have a chunk of home with me, not just the glass that's, you know, served for at the Clinch River there in Virginia. Oh, um, but also, literal, Damn. a chunk of the earth I stood on and lived on for the first 18 years of my life that my dad literally mined. I mean, then there's the game room, but I've just stacked that shelf recently. And I thought it might be in here, but this is all magic product, including some pretty rare items, but... Magic <sighs> the no no play game. button. I hope we don't have to go to the garage. Yeah, I'm, what, I'm going to be right now to use the garage. It's not gotten much better. Cards. My wheelchair is back in here. That needs to get thrown out. All my Halloween stuff. Over yeah, here, though, you can see that well either. That says fans and stuff. There is several boxes of fan mail. I've gone okay. through it all. Oh my god, I didn't read every letter. This. Even wrote a lot of you guys back back in the day. I hope my YouTube play button isn't there. Because <laughs> there's some good memories in there. There's some bad memories in there too. It hurts a little bit to go through that stuff these days, but uh, it's also really nice too. Also, there's the hole in my ceiling where my ex wife fell through it back in 2016. That was a test. Thank God she didn't Damn. break her neck. Here's my closet. Similar to Homer Simpson's closet, like all my costuming and stuff is in here. Including now the boxer robe. The big, I thought it could be in here. The VidCon thing doesn't count because that was only one video Boogie was in, but. Yeah, that was like eight videos in a row of Boogie and McChicken are just collabing. I don't know how many videos Boogie did on his side, but on Jesse's side, there was like eight or nine videos. It was part of his collab series in 2016. But I just went through this the other day, and I don't think it is. Some cool memorabilia, though, for sure. If you recognize any of that stuff, let me know in the comment section. No, oh, I do suspect it's in here in one of these drawers. I do have so many collectibles. I really look forward to selling some of these yeah, arcade machines. I forgot about this that stuff. I thought it might be on the shelf. It could be in one of these drawers as well. Oh, wait a second. Uh, uh, reaction this video. Is the I think this is the Gamer Channel. Nope. There you go. Classic Boogie one. There we go. Jordy, I got you. I presume Jordy wants me to sign this for him. I have my little signing box of pens and stuff that I take to conventions. So let's see what looks good. I've never signed glass before. First, we'll try my actual name yep. also you should video. know you that, that I never got very good at writing as a southpaw but I feel like that looks pretty good I should personalize it though right I'll personalize it let's see good gesture if it didn't look like uh, you know it was drawn on by a fourth grader huh so yeah, there you go Jordy um, I'm as only as good as my word and my word is for you I'm gonna send you this video do me a favor text me your address so I can send you the play button brother and uh, it was a good fight I mean it was better for you for sure <laughs> but I look forward to getting this mail for you brother and this puts the entire fight saga behind me now, I think. We're on to the, the next thing, whatever it is. 
Uh, I got to figure out what to do with all the costuming and the gear and all the other stuff. But uh, at the end of the day, I look forward to getting back to making my normal content. So, as always, guys, thanks for watching. I love you very much. And I will speak with you again soon. Yeah. Talking about shit over there. Alright. Well, that was a good video. I'll showcase a lot of his collectibles, Magic Gathering, that one uh, clay thing that he showed. I think I saw a PlayStation 4. But, um, yeah. But yeah, that's the end of this video. There will be three more reactions for this channel today. And, uh, but we finally uploaded. Again, I didn't upload those last two videos because one of them I watched and the other was a stream. Alright.